Long Riders! Welcome back to Everything Fly Fishing. Welcome to your Tuesday video. Today we're going to do a hackleless Adams. No hackle required. It sits right in the waters, in the surface film. So it'll be taken for an adult or an emerger. It's a deadly fly. And uh, let's get to the vice. Let's show you this fly. We start with a size 14 hook and 70 denier black thread. Next we got this floating yarn and I know all you guys are going to call or that uh, message down here and tell me what kind of yarn it is. You have to understand that this yarn is different in every area, different locations, called different things. There's a hundred different kinds of people that make this floating yarn. So we're just going to call it floating yarn so you can find, find it in your local fly shop. And we mix it brown, black, and white. Usually you would mix brown and grizzly, which has black and white in it. So we're just mixing it all and tying it in here. What I like to do is wrap it around the tying thread and it's just put it, fold it in half and put the fold in on the tying thread, wrap your thread down and I'll put it right on top of the hook for you. Okay, put some thread wraps in front of it, some thread wraps between it and you're going to do some figure eights the wing to pull them apart So you're going to run your thread back and get ready to tie in your tail. We just got your regular tail, brown and grizzly hackle fibers combined. Going to measure for length to tie that in. And while you're tying it in, run one thread wrap underneath to make it stick up a little bit. Now you cut off the waist material of your feather or whatever you have, the piece of your tail that you're not going to use. The dubbing we're going to use is gray and yes, I cut this right off the muskrat itself. <coughs> so you use muskrat underbody with no guard hairs if you have the actual muskrat. Um, I like using the real muskrat if possible. Okay, rub this, run this stubbing all the way up against the wing. And when you get to the wing, you pull the wing back and run just a couple wraps of the dubbing in front of the wing leaving yourself enough room to whip finish it. And you're going to throw in the fifth whip, whip finish, but you're not done yet. Now we're going to trim the wing. Pull up on all the 
the fibers together at one time. You can use a hook here to show you how long you want it to be. Cut it off. Ah, oh, just a hair long. Trim a little bit more of that off. Hey, welcome to the video. Glad you made it to the end. Now you can check out some more of our videos. Here's the video that they picked out for you to watch next. And some other tying videos. Watch them all. Tie up these flies. All of them really good flies. You're going to want these flies in your box. Tie them up. Keep your lines wet. Out of the trees. And only give them fish. A sore lip.